Welcome guys. In this video I'm going to show you how we can transfer data uh, from the Nokia 8.1 to older Android smartphone. So for the first we have to get application to transfer data. So we have to move for the Play Store and get application to transfer data, right? And I recommend you to get application name clone it. It's uh, totally free and really easy to use so you don't have to pay for it. It's worth to get it right and on the second smartphone you have to do the same I did it and right now I can open it and do this on your Nokia click allow if you got any requests for the permissions for the location storage or any other you have to accept all of them uh, that is what this application required to work properly right now tap on the yes or agree click sender on your Nokia tap set to no location then go back Okay, um, in a few model of the smartphones, when you tap on this application back, you are going back, but to the settings, to the preview, preview window, right? Uh, but in uh, in the most of case, when you tap it, you you are going back to the client application. So uh, when it happened to you, you have to open the background apps and then just click on this client application. And here we are back. So click sender, click all over the time click allow and on your Android phone tap receiver and right here I'm going to show you how it works so click set to no location and right now when we click back we are not going back to the net to the preview window in the settings uh, but we are going back to our cloned application as you can see it works different as in Nokia so click uh, receiver here tap search again and right now uh, we have to tap on the Android share icon, it is our Nokia, and we have two ways to connect. We can scan this QR code, but also we can input this password manually. So you have to pick your way. I'm going to scan the code, it's just the, the fastest way to connect. Accept the request on your Nokia, and right now, when you want to send everything, you have to click on all of these icons and then tap start. But if you want to get some details, you have to go here below. And I think that we can send uh, what we get here. Uh, I think that we can send the wallpaper. Uh, there's the system setting and also. OK, we are going to send the only wallpaper. It's only the preview. So click start. OK. And it's sending, so we have to wait. And as you can see, it's finished. So right now, we can check how our how our wallpaper has changed. And as you can see, it changed automatically. So that's how it looks. Thank you guys for watching. Leave thumbs ups, comments, and subscribe to our channel. See ya.